Today is World Kindness Day, and we could all use a little boost right about now. Isn't that the truth? Our resident nice guy, Leon Bibb, is here to spread the love in these difficult times. These are challenging times. Unkind actions don't help it. Our newscasts are filled with stories of unkind acts. So someone came up with the World Kindness Day. Not that we need a special day. It ought to be every day. November 13th is World and National Kindness Day. What say we focus on random acts of kindness? We can actually save the world bit by bit every day. We're all anxious in this pandemic. It puts us on edge. We have to be careful not to let those inner feelings, those edgy feelings, boil over to negatively affect someone else's life. You know, just after I got off my mother's knee, she was the first to school me on the importance of kindness. If I spoke in a harsh manner in the schoolyard and mom got wind of it, Leon Douglas Bibb, you apologize right now, mom would say. Her words still echo in my memory. The world could use a little of my mother on kindness. Many of us do get it. Those acts of kindness really are the real foundations of human life. Daily, we see kindness all around us. It ought to be every day. For many people, it is. Look at the little children. In their play, they understand kindness. They learn it in the earliest years of elementary school. Play fair. Watch your words. If you borrow crayons from your neighbor, return them when you are finished with them. Think about how much better our world would be if nations did that and people were kind to each other. Kindness is a fundamental part of the human condition, which bridges the divide of race, religion, politics, gender, and even zip code. Something to think about on this world and National Kindness Day. Oh, by the way, thank you. You were kind to listen. For 3 News, I'm Leon Bibb.